नमस्ते सारस्वती देवी गौरवाणी निर्विशेषा शून्यवादी पाश्चिण जय श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नित्यानंद श्री गौर भक्त हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे हरे राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण यस प्लीज आदि गो फॉर इट प्लीज वी हैव टू डू नरसिमा आरती फर्स्ट यस लेट्स डू नर्स That's right. Very good. And then, would you like to do Narasimha Aarti today? Yes, please. Please go on. Namaste Narasimha. Namaste Narasimha. La 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 la. La 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 la. हिरण्यकाशीपूषा यतो यतो यामी ततो नरसिम्हा यतो यतो यामी ततो नरसिम्हा बाहे नरसिम्हा हृदय नरसिम्हा बाहे नरसिम्हा हृदय नरसिम्हा नरसिम्हा मदिन शरणम प्रप्यदे नरसिम्हा मदिन शरणम प्रप्यदे तब करे कमल भरे अभूत श्रृंगा दलिता हिरण्य कशिपो जगदीश हरे जय जगदीश हरे जय जगदीश हरे जय नरसिम्ह दे नरसिम्ह दे नरसिम्ह दे जय नरसिम्ह दे जय नरसिम्ह दे नरसिम्ह दे नरसिम्ह दे जय नरसिम्ह दे जय प्रलाद महाराज प्रलाद महाराज प्रलाद महाराज जय प्रलाद महाराज जय प्रलाद महाराज प्रलाद महाराज प्रलाद महाराज जय प्रलाद जय प्रहलाद नरसिम्ह जय प्रहलाद नरसिम्ह जय प्रहलाद नरसिम्ह जय प्रहलाद जय प्रहलाद नरसिम्ह जय प्रहलाद नरसिम्ह जय प्रहलाद नरसिम्ह जय प्रहलाद नरसिम्ह जय लक्ष्मी नरसिम्ह जय लक्ष्मी नरसिम्ह जय लक्ष्मी नरसिम्ह जय लक्ष्मी नरसिम्ह 
Jaya Lakshmi Narayan Singha 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 Jaya Lakshmi Narayan Sing
Krishna. Thank you, Rohan. Very nice. Very kind. And 13 past 3. What a great timing. Let's get in and Kani is here. So, Hare Krishna, Swami. Good to have you. And Agni has just... Hare Krishna. So hopefully today we will complete the 2024 teacher presentation on Lord Dattatwai. So we have seen quite many. Yesterday we were on 17 or oh, on 18, I think. Yeah, but few left and we will cover them today. So just to remind Earth. Air, sky, water, fire, moon, sun, kabutar, pigeon, python, ajka, sea, samudra, no limit, moth, sense gratification, eyes in the fire, honeybee, without destroying the flower, take the nectar away. Like students take the knowledge from everywhere. Elephant, Hathi. We take a lot of things from Hathi, elephant. We didn't do elephant for Gucci. We, we can do... Hare Krishna, Prabhuji. Hare Krishna, Avni. Yes, we did the elephant yesterday, actually. So okay. Yes, Prabhuji, we did elephant yesterday. We did anything. Thank you. Okay. So, what we will do? Uh, Adi, I think you were Prabhuji? not here. Yes, please. Adi. I think we did it up to the um, Indian dancer. That's right. Yes. Thank you. So, uh, Adi, what I will do, I'll send you, I will check. Arin would have uh, uploaded the YouTube and I will share the link with you. So you will have the recording of yesterday, but we did from event going forward with it until 18 yesterday. So we will go forward, but I will share the YouTube link with you and then you can go through the ones you missed yesterday. Okay. Okay. Great. Very nice. So yes, we did Honey Thief. I will, I will briefly remind or mention it again. Honey Thief is the one. Who steals the honey? And honey bees go around and they take a lot of, they collect, they gather. So what this reminds us that we should not gather more than what we need. If we will, then it will not be for our use. Somebody else is going to make the use of it. What we are going to do, we will be very anxious. We will be very stressful. We will work very hard to gather those things which are not necessary for us. They are material. And any at the end, like this thief is going to use the honey, not the honey bees. Somebody is going to use all that extra things we gather. So we should not do the endeavor to gather a lot of extra things. And then we saw from the deer, children, that just by music, Hiran gets deer, gets attracted, and that's why I get hunted by the hunter. We should control our senses. We should not get into sense gratification and into the trap of my fish. Muchli, very similar thing. Muchli gets into the bait. Even though the fish has seen, but still. Yes, please. One day are we going to revise all of this? We certainly can. I'm thinking what will be really great. How about this? Today is Tuesday. So next session will be on Friday. No, well, I said Friday, RM says Saturday. Both of us are wrong. It's on Sunday. Yes. Next session will be on Sunday. So what we can do, we can revise it on Sunday. And maybe we can try. 
I will request Arvin if he can put together a quiz. Kahoot. Oh, he's saying Kahoot. But Kahoot, then everybody needs uh, everything and it goes fast and all. We will see. But thank you very much, Avni. I think it's a great plan. We will try to put something together and then that work as a... Uh, because they are, they are teaching for the teacher. So yes, you can certainly do something. It will motivate everyone to go through back and revise every, all of these. Yes, Professor. Yes, that will be really nice. Fantastic. Yeah. Thank you for that, Avni. I think that's a great idea. Thank you. Okay, Prabhuji. Okay. And then we have Divesh. Okay, Divesh has joined, which is great. Divesh and Divesh are both are here. Good to have you. Both of you are doing well. And yeah. And if you remember, we are doing 24 teachers of Lord the Tathwe. And today we are adamant that we're going to finish the 24 teachers. So moving forward, we said, yeah, number seven, the dancing girl, like the dancing girl. Expect a lot of expectations this dancing girl has. So we should just have a lot of expectations. If we have the expectations, then we will not have contentment. We will not be contented. We should have content with whatever Krishna has given us. And then we have seen number 18, bird of prey, hawk. This is another thing for the possessions. A lot of people to possess, they get possessive. Like children, they say, oh, this is my toy. And that could be just a plastic thing. It's not... after a while, the kids, they grow out of those toys. Yeah? But then they be possessive. They want to keep it. They don't want to share with it. And as long as we have any kind of possessiveness, we will not be happy. We will not be enlightened. So to be happy, we need to release all the possessions. We need to leave all the attractions we have for anything. We should only desire one thing and that's Krishna. And if we desire Krishna, then everything else will automatically fall into place. And we will be very happy. Oh, And then we have a cute child. And Adi's camera is on so we can see Adi is smiling. Looking at this cute. Yeah. Okay. So, 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 so cute. Okay. So, could we request Devesh? To please read this slide. Divish, could you please read this slide and then we will discuss or if you want to say something in your words after reading it. Or just read it anyways to start. Can I add? Yes. Okay. Yes. A child has no grievance, anger, jealousy, hatred, and above all free of ego and arrogance. Both child and sage are free from any and and cities and and right. fully embrace supreme joy. A mm. child is happy and joyful due to ignoring, while sage is happy from, is happy free from all worldly desires, which is transcended the three gunas, sattva, rajas, and tamas. Yeah. Teaches. Like live like being a child at her innocent, carefree, and full of supreme joy. Hare Krishna. Thank you, Devesh. And I think it's very clear. You might have heard that a lot of people they say that oh, be happy as a child. Oh, a smile. He has a childish smile. Yeah. Or oh, a lot of times when people make the joke or they laugh and they say, oh, I'm just kidding. Why? Because the kids, because I'm the kids. Yeah, I'm just kidding. So because the children, they are all, I mean, when we say children, it's not of your age. The infants, because they, they are not attached, they don't know anything. And that's why they are not worried. Whether they are wearing anything or not, 
They don't care what they are eating, whatever they grab, they put it in the mouth. Now, what Lord Dattatre is not saying that we should act like a child and we should always uh, be as carefree as a child. But what Lord Dattatre is teaching us that if we learn this from child, that like child is happy all the time. Child doesn't care for anything. So if we think about it, we if we will not care in a sense, not that we are not responsible, but we don't need to worry about things, especially those things which are not in our hand. Now, for example, these days, a lot of people, they sit at a home and they working from home. They can't go out and they say, oh, I don't know what's going to happen. Everywhere people are dying is COVID, you know, I can't. Imagine this is going on. This is the worst time in the planet. Oh, <laughs> now, what do we achieve by this? Nothing. Do we solve this problem? No. This anxiety is just because we think we will be able to do something. However, we will not be able to do something. So it says, child is happy because child is infant. Yes, please. Because ch kids are always happy. So once I was a baby and a spider walked across me and I kept on laughing. Wow. Yes. And then her mother saw it and said, why are you guys laughing? And she got the spider off of him. <laughs> yes, true. Now that's the thing. If we will see a spider, we might run away. If a child will see the spider, then child will run towards the spider <laughs> and then spider will run away from the child. Have you, have you seen this? And this happens a lot. For example, a dog. If you will see a dog. Okay, are these saying something? Then probably you will run away from the spider. Yes. True. True. Yes. And similar thing applies to the dog. You will see and you will have some previous experience and you will run away or we will run away, I will run away. But those who will not run away, the dog will get scared. But well, obviously, if the dog is friendly, dog will get friendly. But otherwise, most of the time, dog will get scared. So that's why we say that the best thing when you see the dog is not to move. And then dog will realize, okay, this person is not scared, then dog will get scared. But the same thing applies that we should not. Just like child is not attached with anything, child is always happy, so is the sage. Sage is the wise person. And we should be very much like that. Nothing we can do about anything. So why do we worry? And if we can do something about anything, then why do we worry? There's no reason to worry. But that's what we can learn from child. Always remember next time you're going to see the child, then child is not bothered, child is not anxious, and we should be the same. Stress-free, no stress required, especially when you cannot do anything. Okay, it says, young girl. In, in named girl. Unnamed girl. Unmarried girl. Ah, I something in between. Oh. Oh, this is a picture. Okay, young girl, unmarried girl. So what do we learn from there? Let's see. Who can read that? Pihu, could you please read this? I can't see the PowerPoint. Oh, you can't see the PowerPoint? Okay, no worries. In that case, I request Arun to read it. Arun, could you please read it? When there are a number of spiritual thinkers living together, there will be a clash of interests. Even among two persons, there might be a dispute. The sage should live al alone in solitude, as it is better to live alone without cre creating any unwanted noise gossip gossips. Right, thank you, yes. So you might have seen that sometime it happens if there are two girls and if there is only one toy or if there is one dress, like Shivani is there, Shivani's cousin is there, 
and if their uh, granny grandmother will only get one dress or one toy both of them would like to have it i want it i want it i want it so this yeah, is this is when they don't want to share and the the word they have used there is a clash of interest what does that mean sometimes when we work in teams then one person wants something another person wants something else for example mother and father are there at the front of the car seats and they're going towards the temple now they are following gps for some reason gps doesn't work gps broke down so then they decided to switch off gps now they don't know which way to go now mother says go left father says go left right and then sometimes they go left sometimes they go right and they never reach to the destination because both of them one person wants go left one person wants to go, go right and again this happens a lot then what we need to do we need to have a clear leader whom we can follow at least even if we will go a bit wrong then we will reach there at a wrong place and we realize it and then we can turn back and we can head towards the right thing right place right direction but if both of them will keep saying and there was a there was a funny story there is a place in india which is very famous for the politeness people are very polite very humble and there were two guys from that city and a train comes the very first one says to the second one please you go first i will wait and the second one says no you go first i will wait i will come after you the first one says no 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 you go first i will wait for you i, I will board the train after you and train is there right and when train stops train stops only for few minutes maybe 10 minutes and these two they are there right at the bottom of the steps because they are like three four steps to get inside the train and they are just waiting there and they just keep saying to each other no you go first you go first you go first you go first and then what 10 minutes later the train whistles and then goes away none of them could able to get on to the board board the train why because this is what we say when two people clashes now that this clash was not the nasty clash but again this clash was not the wise clash so we should remember this when we are in the family sometimes for some things we need to be alone and some things we need to do in the team work so always remember that that when to be alone when to be in the team work this is a very good skill and we always need to have a leader in the team if we have already decided there is a leader then you are a member of a team and you can suggest what you want but never conflict so this is what we learn from the young girl because two girls sometimes cannot decide on one thing okay now this one is called arrow maker now you might not have seen but olden days bow and arrow used to be the biggest weapon that's what people used to carry now you will see lord ram you will see in mahabharat in bhagavad gita arjun and all other warriors adi you said something one was some of the five pandavas yeah. two of them of the five pandavas are use bow and arrow yes like arjun and i don't know the second one Okay. Bow and arrow. He, he won't really call him a panda, but still, he was still kind of. If you look at it, he's a panda. Panda. Okay. Okay. Yes. Yes, please, Avni. I know the name of Arjun's bow. Okay. Yes, please. Let us know. The name of Arjun's bow is Gandiva. Yes, that's right. Ah, And the name of Karan's bow is the Vijay Vijay Dhanush. That is Guru Parashuram bow. that's right yes so yeah both of them were great archers 
but if you see the what is bow and arrow so there is a big bow as of said, the name of the bow was gandhi but then there are arrows now arrows are supposed to be straight very straight very very straight not only that they are supposed to be straight but right at the end there is a tip of the arrow because the tip of the arrow is the first part of the arrow which is going to reach to the destination whether is to kill the enemy or whether is to demonstrate how good archer you are now imagine if you will you might have seen the i forgot the name of that game what game that is darts yes thank you arun just reminded me in darts if you see you have bulls eye now in the archery also we have bulls eye now imagine then there is a best archer there but his arrows are not good he shoots but the arrow arrow reaches to the bull eye but the tip of the arrow is not good enough and that's why it doesn't stick there and falls down and the same thing if let's say arjun is hitting his enemy and the arrow reaches there because he's the best archer but the tip of the arrow is not good enough is just not going to damage the enemy just blunt yeah it will be just blunt so what it says the arrow maker is so much focused concentration the higher topmost concentration while making the arrow but even the higher concentration is required to make that tip of the arrow very taper very sharp when we devotees when we think about krishna when we think about our devotion we should be like this as a student when we prepare for the exams we should have that focus we don't think about anything else our mind should be focused we should have the concentration that we just see that the way arrow maker used to see the tip of the arrow so if it's chemistry exam maths exam we should we should think and focus only on that nothing else and that's what we learn about arrow maker the focus the concentration mm. the next is serpent snake now says prabhuji yes please avni vasuki is the king of serpent yes vasuki is the king of the serpent and where was vasuki was used what do we remember yes um when yes prabhu ji gods and demons were turning the milk okay yes avni what do you say okay i'll just agree with you that he is very huge okay yes so shivani also said that at the time of in hindi we call it samudh manthan the churning of the ocean when demons and demigods they did the churning of ocean during that leela during that past time vasuki the serpent was used as the rope but what lord datatre is saying here is the snake lives alone and avoids the company of other creatures and so again the stress is on the stress is on the self so now this doesn't mean that we should live alone but this does mean that rather than focusing on somebody else we should focus on ourselves so rather than saying oh he needs to improve or she needs to improve he is not doing that she is not doing that always think how you can improve yourself 
So Arun will not say, "Oh, Shivani needs to improve." Shivani will say, "I need to improve," and Arun will say, "I need to improve." So Pihu will not say, "Kuhu needs to improve." Pihu will say, "I need to get even better. I am very good dancer, but how can I become even better?" Right. So this is what we understand when we hear about. the when we hear about the snake or in isolation okay i just got the message that within 5 minutes the call will be disconnected and if you like to get connected back again feel free to do so okay can we do hari krishna please for booky Uh, yes. Well, I think we still have some time. Do we? Maybe yes. Let's check. Yes. Yeah, we still have some time. Let's just say uh, there are two more teachers. Let's do them, and then we can do Hare Krishna Mahamantra. Okay. All right. Okay. So let's discuss the last two. spider now spider is very famous in bhagavatam the example of spider is given but let's see what it says here the same example now i'm not sure if you know about it but spider is very fit well i'm sure you know about this spider the spider is very famous for making the web and you might have heard i hope that tanmay has read the book because this is very famous book for 11 plus and it's called charlotte's web charlotte's web charlotte's web yes tanmay i've not read it by friend yes avni i also read a bit of charlotte's web ah very nice and there is a movie on this as well so which which is also very nice so yeah so it's charlotte's web Okay, nice. Yes, and certainly I did not until I read Bhagavatam. I did not know about this about spider. I knew, like I'm sure you would know, that spiders they make the web. But what I did not know that spiders they swallow the web. So it's like you have you play with your toys right at the end. You just put all your toys back again. So what they do, what the spiders do, they beautiful. And again, it's a very, very nicely explained and illustrated how the spider. But it's just very artistic the way they form their webs. But after that, yes, please, Avni. I don't know. Spiders follow their web. Sorry, Adi. I did not know either, Adi. And that's the beauty of reading our scriptures. That would they play with this as long as they want, and after that they just swallow the same web. As Now, if it grows. Well, you could think so, but what we understand is that this is this is how Krishna keeps this material world. So Krishna has created it. and then right at the end when krishna wants krishna can take everything away so nothing in this world belongs to us even an even our body within our body and i was just saying to someone think about it you will say this is my body yeah Probably. i'm sure yes please you told that in cha- in chapter 2 Yes, we did that in chapter two. Well done, Adi. We did that in chapter two that we are not body, we are soul. But still, we say, "Oh, these are my eyes." And now think about it: in eyes, or on eyes, we have eyelids. And do we have control over our eyelids? Not really. How how long do we keep? We can, but water will come from our eyes. Yes. and water will come out and very soon what will happen we won't be able to control it for long now yes you're right some people may be able to control for 5 minutes some 10 minutes 100 minutes yes 
with practice, maybe a bit longer, but not for long because it's so not in our control as such. But what about the heartbeat? What about the heart? Can we stop our heart? Okay, for a while. How about this? Today is Sunday. Heart. What? We can only control it when we're dead. Yes. So, mm -hmm. Sorry, Adi. We can only control our heart when we're dead. Yes, that's. Hare Krishna. So I'm not sure if everyone is back. Yes, please. I'm back. Okay, great, Avni. Very nice. Okay. Well, we'll see if um, I have another link for the Zoom. If it, if it looks like this WebEx is going to go for now. And uh, this is not very convenient, but we will see. Maybe by next week, if it will not get sorted, there is a Zoom link uh, here, and then we will we'll go on that. Okay. But for now, so yes, this is what we learned from Spider that uh, the way Spider does it, Krishna does the same, and nothing belongs to us our heart, our kidney, our liver, nothing. So everything belongs to Krishna that created it. And that's the reason nobody could give birth to a baby. Like we, we give. But we are just instruments, but we cannot plan it. Well, some people say we plan it, but that planning is a very rough planning. And similar way, we cannot, so we, so humans cannot give birth with their own power, Krishna to do it. And that's why medical science can only support it to make it a bit better, like the facilitators. But Krishna is the one. Nobody could say, okay, I want to give a baby today. Oh, I will make that person, that rich person will give me one billion pounds or one gazillion pounds. And I will, no scientist can say that I, I can save that person not to die. Only Krishna can do it. And that's, that's what we can learn from a spider. The way a spider does it, Krishna can do it. We can't do it. We are just instruments, but sometimes we feel we do it. For example, if you think you go, we go to the bank. These days we don't really go to the banks, but all the time we go used to go to the bank and we give money to the bank, the cashier. And the cashier used to take all the money. And if cashier will think this money belongs to me, but not really. That that money belongs to the bank. The same thing if we go to Tesco, Sainsbury, Marks, or there are many other grocery shops. Then if the person there, the person who is the cashier at the checkout, if that person will think, oh, today I got so much money, then that person is not very wise because that money belongs to the owner of the supermarket, not for that person. Similarly, it doesn't belong to us. It, everything belongs to Krishna. But because we have a little bit of control, we think it belongs to us. But it's not. And very nice. Okay, so there are two paragraphs. Who would... Okay, sure. Well done. Like for example, Vishnu. He created Vishnu, so he won't have to just deal with all the work. He'll just give Vishnu one of the earth. He'll give Brahma one of the part of the earth like that. Good point. Very good point. Yes. But that can't be given in the spider because the spider doesn't make makes different ways. Yes. So. Yeah. yeah. Right. Thank you. Right. Rohan, may I request you to read the first uh, few lines, the first paragraph, please? A wasp catches hold of a worm, um, or known as a caterpillar, put it in its hive, also known as a nest, gives it a sting and goes on buzzing about it. The caterpillar is so frightened by this whole ongoing process of buzzing that it cannot think of anything else apart from wasp. The constantly kept thinking of caterpillar about wasp eventually makes a caterpillar a, wa a wasp itself. 
<laughs> That's a scary. Thanks, Rohan. And Arin, would you like to read the last <coughs> part, please? Okay. It teaches. What form a man con constantly thinks of, knowingly, unintentionally, be it with love, jealousy, or fear, etc., he attains in course of time that form. As a man thinks, so he becomes. Even at the time of death, Whatever one's mind focus on, one attains the same living species in his next life. Thus, one must try to give up all attachment to the body and attain moksha or liberation. If one constantly, devotedly, without any sort of deviation, meditates upon the Supreme Personality of Godhead, one will achieve the spiritual body, just like that of the Lord. Qualitative. Very nice. Thank you. Yes. Again, this shows the power of association. If we stay with good people, those people who have good habits will become good. We will get their habits. If we will associate ourselves with the bad people, those people who have bad habits, we will get their bad habits. If, for example, if you like badminton, if you will play badminton with somebody who is not that good in badminton, then you are not going to improve your skills in badminton. You might get worse. You might get worse. This is what Aryan says. But if you will play with someone whose badminton skills are great, then definitely initially you will struggle. But very soon what you will notice that you will slowly, slowly, gradually, you are improving because you are playing with the best person, best sports person. So this is the power of association is. And that's another thing I didn't know about animals, no, or in this case, the insect, that when the wasp catches a warm caterpillar, for example, then it buzz. I will try this on Aryan. Ah. So, it happens. Because if, and we did Ramayan, well, Tanmay did the session on Lord Rama. In Lord Rama, Lord Rama's, well, in Ramayan, Lord Rama's mother, the, not the real mother, but Kekai, who used to, who was a stepmother, but she used to love Lord Rama just like Bharat, just like her own son. And Kekai had mantra. Kekai had mantra. Yes. And it wasn't just like very first go when mantra said something wrong about uh, Lord Rama. That Kekai said, oh yes, you're right. No. She said once. And Kekai said, what are you saying? Ram is my son. Don't you ever dare to say that. But again, after a while, she said the same thing again. And she kept saying it, kept saying it, kept saying it. This is the power of association that right at the end, she just lost it. What she should have done, she should have stopped the association of that maid. But because that maid came from her parents side, she did not want to leave her. And sometimes this is what happens. We know that friend of ours got bad habits, but for some reason we, we would still continue with the association. We should not. Because sooner or later, we are going to get the good habit or bad habits from the people we associate with. It's a bit like Khan because Khan, he, got his, he, he became the Yodan's friend and then he got some of the bad habits that the Yodan had. He knew that the Yodan was bad, but still, he stayed yes, with Yes, that's right. Very nice. Yes, very, very nice. Fantastic. Okay, so... We should always remember, we have seen 24 teachers and if I will say three things, what we can learn, the very first thing is about the association, what we just discussed. And the second thing is about the sense gratification. For example, the moth. We have seen the moth, moth will see the fire and moth knows that moth is going to die, but still moth goes and burn himself or herself. The same thing with those people who drink and smoke. They know very wisely that 
it's written on the packet, but still they smoke, still they drink. They should not. First thing is association. Second thing, what we said is the sense gratification. We should not get into second sense, sense gratification. The third thing is what we learn from the nature. Remember the very first thing we learned? Earth, air, water, fire. What else? There was one more. Space, he says, ether, he said. Oh, well, we have the next slide. Don't worry. Okay. Earth, air, sky, water, fire. I think we said all five. So, if you think of that, then natural resources, they teach us so many things. So many things. So, we can learn from the natural resources. We can learn from the trees. We can learn from the animals. We can learn from the birds. We can learn from the insects. We can learn from the bangles. We can learn from, well, the bangle is uh, where there is an unmarried girl and she's wearing the bangles. If she has more than one bangle, then it's going to make noise. But if she's only wearing one bangle, it's not going to make noise. And what did we discuss? That sometimes if there are more than one people, then they could have clashes in interest. That's what we learned from Bangal. But we could learn from the baby. So there are so many good things we can learn from all of the people around. Yes? Okay. So there are three minutes left. Now, who would like to do Hare Krishna Mahamantra and then we will finish for today? I will. Yes, please. <laughs> Go for it, Christian Chetan. Hare Ra, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, thank you so much, Krishna Chaitanya. Thank you so much, Rohan, and thank you so much, Tanway, for providing your association. It was so good to see you. And thank you to all those who could not come back. But we will see you on Friday, on Sunday now, Sunday at 6 p.m. And we will revise. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Wait, isn't Goodbye. tomorrow at 3? Not tomorrow at 3, because tomorrow is Wednesday. Remember, we said we will only... We have reduced to three days only.